This is an electric hydrofoil surfboard, which can fly above any body of water at speeds of up to 25 miles per hour. The electric hydrofoil surfboard, or e-foil for short, is one of the newest arrivals to water sports. One of the best features about this hover surfboard is you can always ride it regardless of the conditions, such as no wind, waves or paddling required. Plus I like how it disassembles small enough to fit into a car, so no towing required either. So how does it work? Well, the Hydrofoil surfboard has a wing-like structure underwater, and when travelling at speed, lifts the surfboard above water. This will essentially eliminate the drag caused by the board having to cut through the water's surface and any small choppy waves that may be present. The e uses an advanced lithium-ion battery to power a silent electric motor which is mounted on a carbon fibre hydrofoil, all controlled with a wireless Bluetooth hand controller and riders can fly for up to an hour at speeds of up to 25 miles per hour or 40 kilometers per hour. The hydrofoil surfboard can be used by a wide range of people, everyone from total beginners looking for fun to top athletes seeking a thrill. But the company does recommend ages 16 and up who weigh less than 250 pounds or about 113 kilos. Lift Foils is the first company to produce an electric hydrofoil surfboard and was started in a garage 10 years ago in Puerto Rico and now builds hydrofoil surfboards for customers all over the world. The company uses the latest battery pack technology from the car industry and worked with top US engineers to create a custom lithium ion battery pack built specifically for a rugged marine environment. When I first heard about this project, to be honest, I thought it was crazy. A surfboard that flew above the water and was wireless and you had a wireless hand controller, it seemed like something out of science fiction. But once you actually thought about it, it all made sense and it actually was possible with today's technology. Every year we're seeing an improvement between 5 and 7% of energy density and power density for batteries. And so you can imagine over a period of a few years, compounded, that ends up in, say, a 30, 40, 50% increase in power. So we could see smaller, lighter batteries that have the same output or larger batteries that allow you to go farther and faster. Through this product, one of the reasons I'm so excited about it is it gives people the feeling of the future. It's clean, it's electric, it's green, it's quiet. Riding the lift foil is an incredible experience and I think the more people get that experience, the more people have to look forward to, to a battery powered future. So I'm very excited about that and happy to be doing my small part to make that happen. I've always envied those who own boats or jet skis, as I've always wanted one, but I have nowhere to store them at home, or any desire to tow them about to boat launches. But the best part of an e-foil is, you simply go to your favourite body of water, such as a beach, lake or river, park the car and walk the board down to the water and assemble it. But this convenience does come with a hefty price tag of $12,000. Now it may lack the thrill of a jet ski, or the endurance of a boat, and it may be a bit pricey for just an over-glorified surfboard, but at least you can enjoy flying above any body of water with little to no effort involved. Now all you need is $12,000. Anyway, that's the end of this video. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.